hello and welcome in this video i will talk about and demonstrate a nice functional written feature called generate customer and vendor payments from bank statement and reconciliation so this feature is available from trend 36 version and in this is in preview stage let's see what is this feature about in this demo so now i am in microsoft dynamics 65 finance and operations after enabling this feature i will showcase what is this feature is about so i will go to bank reconciliation you know before that i have created this bank statement okay this bank statement and in this bank statement is a mt940 imported bank statement and for in this bank statement i have two transaction 1500 debit and 5500 debit okay and then for that bank statement i have created this worksheet and in worksheet as well in this bank statement transaction is visible but you know at uh, as part of bank reconciliation process user has or i have not realized that this is the transaction where customer has paid towards our bank but this transaction are not booked into the system so the way only way to do to complete the reconciliation is that go back to the customer payment journal record this as a customer payment journal and then come back and then only this bank statement will show here and then the reconciliation can be completed However, after enabling this feature, I can directly select this bank statement transaction and from here only I can generate the payment journal. So I will just select the customer payment or the vendor payment. So I have realized, okay, this is the customer payment which customer has paid to us. I will select customer payment and then system will ask for which this you know, transaction is for which customer. I have selected, okay, this customer is for and I can select method of payment as well from here only. Okay, I can select date. So booking date means this is a booking date in bank statement. I can select specified date as well on which date I need to book this transaction in system and bank transaction type, sales tax group, item sales. So everything is possible. And this automation, I would say it's just cutting down one step from the system and enabling it, enabling, I mean, Dynamics is enabling it that, okay, from bank statement only, I can generate the payment journal. And not only that, I will show you but before that I will show how to set up this so this is the overview of uh, the feature but I will also show how to enable or how to enable how to configure this feature so the only configuration is required in the bank master which is I mean the bank master form and under bank master under the reconciliation form there is a new two fields called customer payment journal and vendor payment journal it is helping the system to automate the payment process or payment posting process so whatever the journal we are selecting here say suppose as an example customer payment journal we have selected cust p while we are creating the payment from the bank statement it will take this journal and it will post automatically to the customer payment journal form this is the only configuration we record after en enabling this feature now we will we will see the demo the automation we will quickly jump into the cash and bank management form and then bank reconciliation where we have left to complete the payment process so now which i have showcased earlier i will select this either i can select one by one i can select multiple doesn't matter i will select two of this and i will click on generate payment journal so now i have i will select customer payment if that is vendor payment, I can also select vendor payment. But for this case, let's complete the customer payment. And then say, and the, uh, likewise, you can also test with vendor payment. Same way it will work. I will select the customer. Okay. So I will select this first customer, maybe. And I will select method of payment. Say electronic payment or any other method of payment. I can select specified date as well to so give the date and which date the transaction will be posted or I will select the booking date. Booking date means this booking date from the bank statement date. I can select bank transaction type. This I will skip. Now I will just click OK. Let's wait. It is basically directly posting to the customer payment journal. We will see the transaction as well. And if you noticed that this pop up has come and this transaction is no more customer payment journal this is generated and posted to the selected bank statement line which means 
not only it is posting the or not only it is automating the process it is also matching the transactions between those so you see this is this has been matched with this and if i select the 500 the 500 has been matched with this after posting it automatically okay and i can also once it is done i can click on mark as reconciled okay it is it is reconciling and it has been reconciled before we complete this demo we i want to see this transaction which has been posted by the system it is very important to see the transactions let's go to the bank maybe or maybe the customer i can say we'll go to the customer and this customer we have posted selected that we'll click on transactions so these two transactions have been posted on 110 2023 this was the transaction we have selected and it has automatically posted to this customer and not only posted it has been reconciled automatically matched automatically and we need, we just clicked on reconcile okay and this is the automation which is uh, Microsoft has released in D1036 version as a preview feature. I hope this has been useful and this will be very much helpful because this is a very common scenario across the industry. Uh, okay, in some way it, it you know it can be utilized. And uh, before we conclude this demo, I also uh, want to show that the customer payment journal how this has been posted by the system i will go to the posted one and this is the automatic posting which has been posted by the system from the bank statement see it is the customer payment if i go to lines now we noticed uh, uh, you notice what see 1500 as a credit in the customer in the bank it is debit so this transaction have been posted automatically by the system okay payment it has received everything system has done it we have not done anything from the bank statement has posted automatically so okay and uh, and if i go to uh, okay if i select this one i will just show one voucher the voucher from the accounting point of view if you see bank has been debited and the trade receivable has been credited so that's the accounting expected entry which uh, system has done as part of automation so that's it for this video i hope no, uh, this uh, this will be useful. Uh, you know, in many cases, in many there will be many use case for this scenario. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye for now.